Daniels with another Game of the Year nominee. Have fun. All right, Jedi have Star Wars, Trekkies have Star Trek, but gamers, they have the epic space opera Mass Effect, one of my favorite games, of course. And joining me now is the executive producer of Mass Effect series, Casey Hudson. Always good to see you, Casey. Welcome good. to the VGAs. Thank you. It's good to be here. All right, so a Game of the Year nominee, Mass Effect 3, and uh, an exciting time at BioWare, a time of yep. transition. Yep. First, talk about Mass Effect 3 and what it meant to you guys to kind of wrap up that trilogy. Well, you know, I think I think people look at these games and you kind of assume they're just going to happen and they're going to come out. and. Um, but it's actually really hard to plan out, you know, a, a series of games and actually get it done. It's a tough industry. You know, even getting a game done is really hard. So to be here and kind of celebrating the work of the team over the, the whole series really is, is, is really an honor for us and, and to be nominated. Uh, it's great to see the team recognized that way. Yeah, is the simple achievement of completing the trilogy with such, you know, intricate details like Mass Effect, is that the biggest accomplishment or do you take away something more about storytelling or some of the other precedents that it set? Yeah, I mean, the whole thing has been a learning process for us. If, if you go back to the very beginning, we actually didn't even know if we could create digital actors that could convey emotion right. in the way that, that you know, we, we were able to get to over the course of the series. Um, and those characters are, are kind of, I think, where people really bonded with the story and it became personal to them. And uh, we didn't even know we could do that until we started trying to figure out these techniques. Yeah, obviously Mass Effect is a huge universe for you guys. Uh, both Ray and Greg have left and moved on to do different things, but you're obviously at the helm of Mass Effect. And uh, talk about what the attitude is towards Mass Effect at Bioware right now. Is it just as exciting from the beginning? Is it a time of rebirth? It is It is a time of transition. Um, you know, my team, you know, we're moving on to some, some new IP stuff, a, a whole new uh, kind of gaming world. And uh, at the same time, I continue to oversee the, the future of Mass Effect. Um, we have a, a studio in Edmonton, that's where we're based. And uh, we also work with uh, our studio in Montreal. They've done more and more in the Mass Effect series over the, over the course of uh, the last several games. So uh, they know Mass Effect as well as we do now. And that's going to be the base for the next stuff that we do in the Mass Effect universe. Awesome. Well, we can't wait to see what's coming up next for Mass Effect. Congratulations, obviously, on all the nominations tonight. Best of luck out there. And thanks for stopping by the stage. Great. It's always good to see you, Casey. Thank you. All right. Thanks so much. All right, Justine, let's give out uh, some more hardware, shall we?